Hey guys, it's Wendy here with Wendy's Plans, and today, guys, I got my Hobonichi box, so stay tuned. Okay, guys, so we are going to open this box. I don't know if you guys have been watching all the unboxings like I have done, and I'm getting excited, and I cannot wait, let's see if I can get this out, to show this to you guys. So let me get it turned over, and what I'm going to do is just go ahead and take everything out, um, and then show you everything at one time instead of trying to fight this box. So I'm sure everybody has seen the um, the yellow box by now. So I am going to take all of this out. Ooh, this is my new box, my new cover. I'm so excited. Alrighty, so let me sit this over to the side. Okay. So I did get another clear cover on cover to go for my, on my weeks. That's going to be for me for my social media. So I'm going to set that to the side. Um, the other thing that I got was, um, this is a card index. It's like a card holder to go inside my Hobonichi cousin um the the actual cover and this is sized for like credit cards and stuff i am going to use my new cover as a um a wallet so i wanted to have something extra to put cards like my shop cards like you know your grocery cards and all of that kind of stuff in so that's what this is going to be and then i got three packs of the index tabs I wanted to be able to put the indexes on there and I decided this year to go with the ones from Hobonichi so you have the ones that are a little bit bigger and then the ones that are smaller and so what I'm thinking is I will use one set for my AVEC and one set for my um, weeks that I have ordered and I just had an extra pack just in case. So again, this year I am going with the Avect. Guys, I know this is horrible sound, but um, so the Avect is the cousin divided into two boxes, two books rather, and it is your you get your regular calendars you've got um current year previous year and next year and then you've got um, people use this for a lot of different things but it's like a perpetual calendar and then you go into your months this actually starts in december or the monthlies do and um it'll take you through let's see This goes through June, and again, this is split into, oops, no, it goes to July, and then it is split into six months. So this is going to be the last few days of December, starting in January 1st, and then it will take us through to June um, 30th, which will cover through the week of July 4th. And then after that, then you have, um, Turn the turn in a page to a new year. Um, I use this as like a, um, a oh girl, I just cannot even think today. I'm so excited to get this a vision board, and I use it for photos, memory keeping, that kind of thing. And then you have your daily pages, and this is the same thing. It's January through the end of June. And this is where I journal. Um, I find that's a good, for me, it's a good use of this section. 
you do have some blank pages and then you have the Japanese pages in the back um, and again I'm glad we kept that on my 100 page for this year and then you have the pages that are in Japanese writing that I had no idea auto but, shutdown initiated and that's my headphones <laughs> but the second book of this picks up again you have the the same setup for the yearly calendars and then you have July through December and then for um, future planning you have January through June and then your calendar start June and go through December I believe actually goes through January it looks like the layout is the same it doesn't look like there's major changes I'm just wondering about I don't have my cousin on my desk it's in my bedroom um, this might be a little bit wider there I don't know I have to look because it might be the same I don't know but it looks really similar to the same as what we're using right now I know last year there were a little bit of tweaks to it but it looks like it's probably the same um, this year and then this book will go through let's see um, the last day is going to be January 2nd and then again you have another vision board type page or memory for me and then um, again I have July through December to do my journaling and then again you've got the same um, stuff in the back that is why I like the Avec is because I can do this one one book that normally would be this thick and I can do it into two and it's not so much to carry and the other reason I like the Avec is because I am going to do it as my wallet this year and I don't want to carry the full year with me if I'm going to be using it as a wallet so the next thing you will see is I have two weeks one weeks is going to be for me which is going to be this cherry blossom pink and I love that they did a darker pink as the year and this is going to be my social media um, planner so this is going to be for a full year so you have from let's see where it starts there's your perpetual calendar and then we have December through let's see where it goes through to it goes to March um, so you have a December to March so you can forward plan and then you start um, November 30th which is really December 1st the week of December 1st and we go to the end of the year I believe yes and then you start your notes pages um, a lot of people will use this as a bullet journal do a page number and the subject and all of that for me all of this is going to be planning videos and social media stuff and that kind of thing so that is what I plan to use this one for this year and then it's got your other Japanese written stuff there and does this one have a my 100 let's look yes it's got a my 100 which I really appreciate that because that's where I track my um, my reading list so mine is this really pretty this guys this is just a really pretty um, pink and it's called cherry blossom and it is really 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 pretty I normally get the botanical cover and I like the botanical cover because it's like grays and beige and all of that this year it had a quite a bit of color on it even though it was beautiful it was absolutely beautiful it just didn't really hit where I wanted to be this year I didn't like as much color was on it so I opted to go with the pink um, for my son's girlfriend I'm not going to open this because this is hers um, she's going to get this for Christmas she wanted the mint so she is getting the the weeks in the mint color now guys 
can't hardly wait to see this, but I'm going to tell you, this cover came out last year, and I wanted this cover really bad, and I just could not order it. I just could not see paying the money for the cover. And I feel like this year it came down in price. I feel like, I don't know for sure, but it wasn't quite as hard to, for me to pull the trigger on it this year. And guys, I've been wanting this cover for so long and I can't wait to show it to you guys. Let's see, where does it open at? I am going to be using my cousin as my on the go, my daily planner, my everything planner. And so I wanted to treat myself to this cover. Guys, oh, I wish you could just feel it. This, oh, and this is a surprise. I did not know that this pocket in the back actually was a pocket. I just thought that was just the seam on the material. So guys on the outside i just love this pocket right to begin with that is amazing that'll be great for putting receipts and my stickers and things like that on the front i'm going to take this little cover protective cover off this is the button that you could have also um, picked up as the search and search and something i don't know um we could just buy the button and this is the button that is closes this cover and this feels like a I have a wool throw that I use in the winter and this feels exactly like this it feels like a wool material um, is all I can say so I'm gonna open this up and when you open it up it is it's not real leather oh guys there is a pocket there oh i'm so excited guys i just can't stand it um but the all the outside is just this material and then the pocket in the back and then this folds completely over to close it and you have two snaps because you know how it gets as you put stickers in there and you load it up it gets a little bit bigger so this opens out completely flat i'm going to take this out it's the protective thing in there so let's see i'm going to leave that in there for now so you've got a secretarial pocket here you have another one here of course the flap that you um put the cover in is here you have the two bookmarks and then here you have a slot which i will probably use for my money cash and then the other side of your Hobonichi slides in here. You've got two little pockets. I'm not really sure what these could be used for. I'm thinking you could probably keep like, I don't know, like a mailbox key or something in here. I, I don't know, guys. I have no idea what they could be useful for. Um, but you have one, two, three, four, five card slots on the side. This is sewn in it's flat there's not a pocket here but as i said you've got a pocket here and then another one underneath you can tuck something in um, so when i'm journaling i can um, leave it open flat and i can journal and this does not get in the way and that was something that i was looking at too because i know i'm going to be using this as my wallet i wanted to have that um, capability. So I'm going to put one of my Cousin of Eck in here, which means, guys, I do need to take this out. And so it is lined with this, um, it's kind of like a nylon filling material um, here. And then my Hobonichi will slide in right here. I'm kind of thinking in this this configuration that I'm going to use, I may not tug this side in. I may leave it this way. I haven't I haven't made up my mind. Um, but you know what? Let's just go ahead and put it in for now until I decide. Okay, 
So then you have your bookmarks. Put one here, and then I usually keep one. Actually, I will put it in with the months, but what I normally do is um, put one in the week Boring that off. I'm working in. For example, I will have it in the week that is the current week, and then I usually keep it in the month that I'm back here in my daily pages is usually where I keep it. So guys, this is what it looks like in the cover, and your pen actually just clips right on the outside. It does not go all the way through, and I do like that it's got a, cup, a thing there. So when it is all closed up, can't see there we go it will snap here there we go and that's what it's going to look like and I love that I have a pocket there guys I cannot wait to start using this I am just so excited um, to have this this year and I really really wanted this last year and so I'm so 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 excited to have it this year now the other things that I got were the free pens, um, so let me take one of these out. I really thought in the preview that I saw that these were going to be a black barrel on these pens, but gosh, they are navy, which I think is so pretty. And um, here we go. So it is a. I don't know if you can tell. But if I turn it this way, maybe you can tell. It is a navy and a real dark navy. It's almost black. And the way you can tell is, let me tilt it this, let me get right here where you can tilt it here. This is blue and then the grip is black. So that is a really nice pen this year. I know it's the same Jetstream pen that we get every year and I'm so excited and because I got two weeks and my Techo cousin, there are three which um, Emma will get one of those. Um, and then we got the Fude Hobonichi No Fude pen which is going to be the brush pen which I'm excited about. And then it has some of the little sheets um, hand sheet paper that you can practice on but it does have the brush the brush pen that you can use for brush lettering I wish I could brush letter I can't but maybe this year I can practice and get you good at it who knows so guys let me get this all out here for you I have my cover I have my the second book, we have my tabs, the card, um, oh, I didn't even try putting that in. Let's try that. So this, I'm thinking I will keep back here in the slot right there so I can keep up with all those, you know, there's all those, I don't, I don't know what they're called. Um, we have a Harris Teeter here and they have a Vic card and we have our food line which has a um, food line card and you know all the stores that have all those cards so I thought I would put those in there then I have the this is just the basic cover on cover let me take this out so it is the basic cover on cover and it is going to be for my my pink weeks. So there we go. And then the um, mint is going to be a Christmas present for my son's girlfriend. If I got her started on the Hobonichi and I buy that for her every year for Christmas. And then the pins. So we'll put those here. So guys, it's a small order this year compared to what I normally get, um, but I am so thrilled to get this order, and I can't wait to do videos with you guys. So I hope you enjoyed it, 
and I can't wait to see what all you guys got too because I'm just loving seeing all the videos. So until next time guys, bye bye.